All right, so the last myth we're going to talk about from the uh, gun grabbing, I want to call it, I guess I can call it the gun grabbing left. <laughs> more guns means more crime. Man, no offense, but that's bull. Man, if that ain't the biggest crime, if more, if more guns equal more crime, I'd be the biggest Trump. I wouldn't be the biggest out there, you know. I got, I got, I got rookie numbers on my gun. Step up your game, dude. Collection. I'm trying to get it up there, but we ain't, we ain't there yet. But we're working on it. All right. Um, studies uh, show that more, more guns do not equal more crime. A lot of times, more guns equals less crime. Why is that? Think about it. Criminals are less likely to target people that they believe to be armed. They're gonna defend themselves. Criminals look for the targets they're looking for weak, um, elderly, older, whatever it is, they're looking for something that's going to tell them that, they, that you will be an easy mark. Okay. Little dude like you, be an easy mark. Okay. If, they, if there's any chance, if you can go into a city, a state where people are armed, the crime is going to go down. So don't, don't be misled by folks telling you that more guns equal more crime. That is just not true. Criminal, if, if, if a... If a criminal's coming down the street and you there and somebody else is there and they just know whatever, you got a gun, you look like you're going to defend yourself and the other one don't, they're going to go after the other person. So don't don't, don't go for the more guns equal uh, uh, more crime. That is just not true. Criminals are not going to target people in areas where they think that people are going to be armed to defend themselves. They want to be easy. They do not want to have to fight you or get shot back at. So we're not going for that, all right?